How's it going, YouTube? In a previous video, we demonstrated the electronic air suspension in the Range Rover, and we talked about extended height mode, which if the, the Range Rover senses it's stuck in a rut or on obstacle, it can give itself just a little more clearance to get out. Well, today we're gonna trick it into doing that. So first, let's put it in off-road height. Before we put it into extended height mode, we're gonna measure it um, from fender well to the ground and see, get a baseline for the uh, height. So let's put the tape measure here about center. And we're just, We're just about at 35 inches. We'll just call it a, a clean 35 inches. In the back, get the tape measured centered. We got a bit more. We're at about, what is that? About 36 and a quarter. So 35 inches up front, 36 and a quarter. All right, so in the video, that I saw by a YouTuber LR Tech. He uses a jack stand under the jack point to trick the rover into thinking he's stuck on an obstacle. So that's what we're gonna do. The jack points on a Range Rover are very easy to find. This big old metal chunk right here. And there's one on every corner of the car. I'll show you. Super easy to find. All right, now we're going to lower the car, excuse me, the Range Rover onto the jack stand and it's going to detect an obstacle and raise itself into extended height mode to get over it. All right, we're going to lower and we have bumped the jack stand. Now we're going into extended mode. All right, we hit the jack stand and it went into extended height mode. So let's check and see how much ground clearance we uh, obtained here. Wow. So we were at 35 inches in the front here and now we're about 36 and a, uh, almost 36 and a, a little over a quarter. That's, that's a whole inch and a quarter gain in the front. Let's check the back. So we were at 30, about 36 and a quarter in the back. Let's get centered up here. 37 and a quarter. So about an inch gain in the back and about an inch and a quarter in the front. Holy cow, look how tall this thing is now. <laughs> that is wild. You know what? I'm going to pull the Jeep up beside it and see how tall it is compared to the Jeep.
look at that. They are almost the exact same height. This is a Rubicon on a three and a half inch lift, 37 inch tires. Same height as the Range Rover in extended height mode. Granted, you are gonna have a lot more clearance with the Jeep. And let's be honest, I'm not taking the Range Rover off-road. But it's still nuts. Well, it doesn't take much driving to see why you can't select extended height mode on your own. There is no suspension travel. Every little bump feels like a three foot ledge. So it's nice to have if you absolutely need it, but you don't want to drive around like this. For me, I'm going to go back to comfort mode. 